Welcome to Onivia, League of Legends Highlights. These are the best highlights from today's LPL matchup. Uncontested start here for WE, which uh, is already onto the board here for W in terms of objectives. Some early dragon uh, cryo here, really nicely done from WE to use that push, and that'll mean that they actually have time to maybe... He doesn't really um, want to leave a turret under his tower, and he's wandering down to the play now as Wayward. He's running. They are going in on the engage here. Here's the Nature's Grasp to come right back. There's the TP onto the ward in the back. Nature's Grasp connecting on a bolt of whatever's GLFS with a big Bramble Smash on. Gets the first blood. They try to get able. Fate Seal not going to connect it there. Why is Cam going for the all out? But he does have to get out after that one. Dragon does get denied. And that really good control on this top side. Yeah, he's a little, little bit of game. All right. Yeah. Oh, you get the oh, eyes. Oh, you oh. die for that. <laughs> I think he does. He just flashed. He has no way out. Oh, goodness. Goes from bad to worse here. He tries to dash at the last second. Vanani will get the kill with the pullback there. So they will punish. They do lose the Rift Herald, but IG have presence on the map now and especially on this top side. So Vampire's used his ult, used his ignite. His pressure is now less, but it is enough to kill Fofo. It might just be. It's still real. They did have the damage, oh, though. And no. here comes the Solar Flare. No! Vampire's down. And now IG. They're on the back foot here. GLFS. He's not as tanky right now, so, just has... Um, that means emphasis on Vampire hitting his good magic storms and actually pulling the front line and the back line together for Rift Up fights. Nani, same thing with his ultimate suit. And also seeing whether Wire Scam can split out someone from the combo as well. Herald's been put down in mid lane for WE. That will set up for the Dragon fight as well. Push in towards mid, have six scrubs, and see if you can get yourself a good fight. Oh, they go in for the engage there. GLFS is going to come around the corner of the face shield. The combo isn't enough. No, Nani goes down. Wayward finds two kills, and he's got that axe spinning around in circles, making IG dizzy straight into the dragon, and maybe even into Wire Scam here. That ghost, he's able to chase him down here. Maybe he's got the perma frost too. Oh my goodness. Why is Cam gonna try to take the fight back? But now the guillotine to get the bleeds down, and he does find an exit with the rest of the team. The all out is it gonna be enough? Maybe they take down Wayward. The flash comes through, and WE they're looking to fight more. That wolf is howling, and Abel's finding a flank. The ADC comes through, and another couple kills go to Wayward. They are playing through their advantage so well here. Well, I'm sorry for giving everyone the script, but IG just did what we were afraid of. They engaged onto the front line. They didn't reach the back line. Vampire hits the tanks. He doesn't get the carries, and Wayward and Able gets so much damage. WE get themselves a huge amount of gold. Wayward takes <laughs> um, So if Wayward um, can then stick in a lane and kind of use the fact that IG have used that nature's graft or may maybe use themselves in the engage combos, things will fall apart. They're going for a big engage. Here they go. Oh, they actually find a big one here. Bofo going down already as WE, they have to find a way to stabilize. This is somewhat of a troubling situation now that they're just burning the Baron. Yeah. So Wayward's gonna come up as well. Vampire, he doesn't have his Magnet Storm now. He's in the brush and now he's been seen. I think WE, I think they can still fight. Abel has all tools oh, available. And Chiang needs to get in the pit. 50-50, it's gonna go the way of GLFS. He might have just activated Griffin. Now Nani goes wide with the Fade Seal. They try to find the back line, they cannot. You still have Wayward, a big dog in this fight as IG scatter to the wind. YS Cam, he's gonna be chased down and he's just gonna have to be the martyr. They did end up getting the Baron. They will get out with a bunch of the buffs and IG finds some life. Yeah, WE slip up in terms of their vision control. IG pounce, YS Cam will go down. Eventually he'll go down. He's not making it out of this one, but still walking away with three Baron buffs from that situation is absolutely um, a heist. Is he gonna get the empowered recall? He might even get himself an execute from this. He's trying. He gets himself damaged there though, I believe. He gets the kill. Hey, Able hey, and it's worse. Thing. He goes to Abel. <laughs> so that's now going to be extended death time for, for Wise Game. 40 seconds dead. Um, problem is, he takes so long to die that WE normally would like to use this to take the dragon. Um, not going to be the case, though, because WE... Unless WE can catch somebody out with those solar flares, with those glacial prisons. And we're seeing Vampire maybe take a little bit of that here. Half his health gone. We'll have time to reset, though, before the fight. This is yeah, like, Nani Joe, I didn't know you were such a good artist. <laughs> there are bunch of fools. <laughs> Uh, shout out to him. Uh, Nani getting himself into this out of tower gold here. WE, they have the six grubs. They've been really struggling to G1. push up. And there is only one teleport from WE because, you know, Darius doesn't run that. Now, WE, are they going to run back towards this too? They're going to get some <laughs> vision control back. Um, right, IG, they still have themselves all of their flash engage tools. This is not good terrain oh, for WE. Yeah, this is a rough pincer right now. Vampire is looking for it. He goes there on. Can't find the engage with the Fate Seal. It's going to find it. And they get already one. Yet Shang is down. They're trying to fight back. IG, they have Wise Cam on the back line. Wise Cam going away though. Look at Fofo. He's got the rockets and Wayward's got the spin. Do they have it though? Wayward, he can't keep it up! 
and he is down. Only a dog is left for WE to stand, and IG, they'll pull it back. They had themselves all their flashes. They had themselves the great engage, and it is only Fofo left alive. I don't think the HP bars, well, I mean, if Fofo walks over, it could be dangerous, but he doesn't have the vision. That should be Baron going over to IG. WE, they slow things down too much, and IG pull the trigger in their own time, in their own leisurely pace. WE giving up another big ejective, even though they get themselves at inner turret, it's gonna Wayward's be We're still in a massive advantage, but we've seen that it doesn't guarantee team fight wins. The focus has been extremely nice from IG, and now the siege is coming to town against WE. They have to find something, some sort of life in this one, because you have to remember, they can't lose a single game. Yeah, they've got it too up. They've got it too up. He doesn't have that flash still. We'll have that cleanse. Dragon coming up in 15 seconds. If IG don't reach the carries and WE's carries then turn around, that will look a lot better for WE. WE have been caught in some really tough positions as they try to exit these objectives. IG have consistently found back lines. They've consistently Vampire. found pin pincer maneuvers. And Vampire will be spotted out. WE feeling a little bit scared here as they set up. Wayward just uh, sticking around in the corner here. He'll be spotted on that ward. Vampire has the Mega Blast cone. cone. They have so much distance that they can cover here. It's a front to back though. Maybe WE can pull this one out. IG feeling a little bit respectful as they back away. Dragon is still the contest here, Dimera. They are contested now. It's 5,000 down. They're going for the Dragon. It goes over to GLFS. Mia the Fade sealed by Nani on the back, but he goes back and now you already got numbers advantage for WE. WE, they take the kills, but they lose that dragon. It's still going to be something. Hang on it oh, on. If he hits another oh. W, this could be a kill. Not just in range there. So, WE, they get themselves at least those kills. Even now in dragons. Dragon conservationists are in tears. Six of them have died. There's probably more to come at this point, as neither team can get themselves that soul. WE, though, showing what this team comp can do if you don't reach those carries uh, again. So, that's going to be a tower going down for them in that bot side and at least claiming some territory on the map, which WE have struggled to do. This is the first time they've really yeah. managed to touch those in a turret. It's be um, beyond Fofo taking that mid lane one in trade for the last Baron. Mid fight here to decide who's going to come away with this game number one as uh, they are just going to leave it. W we're going to leave it. They're going to go towards the Baron instead. There are no saplings up it. there right now, and they're going to try and burn it down. It's not great terrain for WE, but IG, they're teleporting in. This will be YSKM. Nani trying to walk up with the rest of the team. Is this how we go down as WE making the call? They go for the Baron play, but now they are surrounded by IG. They go for the play on the split side, though. GLFS gets a big nature's draft, big face seal, though. Here comes the entrance. Oh, Vampire obliterated, but look at on. He's all by himself. He needs to find a way out no! of here. The escape oh, no! button as he does end up getting back one. Now he's trying to find another. He's going down, though, going golden. But there's nobody in any vicinity to help him. Nani trying to get Abel on the other side. But WE, they are able to fight back. They find the Baron. And now they're pushing down mid lane. Oh, and it's uh, a bit of an awkward flash over the wall from Fofo, but the damage is done. 50 seconds on Arn and a Baron picked up for WE. That should allow them to break the base coming through now. IG, I think they did manage to, to uh, at least scramble and kill that mid lane wave for WE without that Kaiser on the board with six grubs. They might even look for an end of the game. There aren't big ultimates up from IG right now, and they have good tower killing potential. I think they might the even go for the game. Step. Wayward feeling himself even more strongly now. Picked up the Darius and he is laying it down. They are going to fight their way into this one. They still have the Baron minions. Why is Cam getting low? IG, their hope here in this game. They got Nani and that's a huge one. He's going to get a big set off of WE in that fight. The big pick off on Abel. Yeah, they managed to get Abel. He had no cleanse just at the end there. Wait, we're going to tank this up, and it won't be the end of the game. Now Arn is going to come back out onto the map. He's back upside the head by the left. Nani has both these guys having incredible performances to try to close this one out for IG and WE. They have been, uh, they have been bruised. Well. He did have that cleanse. I don't think it saves him, of course, the knockups from uh, what really kills you from, um, from that Yoni. Baron buff still up, though. WE looking to shove in with the waves. And they actually have a pretty heavy siege here. Both are going to take a hit. YSKM, the true front line right now. Nature Grass coming in. This is IG's play they want to try to make. Wayward still heavy front line. Glacier Prison goes wide. The Converge is starting to kick up here. Look at Nani, though. He needs to get in. There's the Blade Collar back. They cut out Yanxi Yang. On finds one. This is what IG needed. They find Mark. That's a double kill for the star on. And they want to follow it up yes, as well. They still have Killer Instinct. Wayward needs to be careful. On stepping up, trying to go for an able body block. Fate sealed in. Able and on. They're going at each other's throats, but it's on who has a team next to him. And IG from the break. It's Wayward. He's trying to fight tooth and nail, but the wolf 
will be turned into a pelt here as IG surround him on all sides. They're going to go for Alco Gaming. He's throwing up the emotes, but it's going to be a sweet, sweet salute. Wait, wait. By They've tried to clutch it out, but their team fighting just hasn't been able to deal consistently with Arn's Kaiser. Yes, Kaiser is shredded. One good fight, and that could seal the fate of either of these teams. In this game, WE getting pushed back now. Nanny teleporting to that bot wave, not able to find a teleport. Here comes Fog Fog, Elder started. It might be game one, but the stress is high. Big engagement! Nanny! Oh Nanny! He finds the massive feed seal, but he's going down. Look at the fight, though, in the Dragon Pit. Ye Yang is completely caught by himself. On the other side, though, IG, they're picking off members. Dragon going low, and Elder has been secured by IG. WE, they're going to be executed, and their hopes and dreams are being dashed in front of their very eyes. WE, they can't clutch it out. Invictus Gaming will go through to the Knights Rivals stage after a blitz of team fights. Team fight after team fight going the way of Invictus Gaming, and they'll win in this hyper late game. What a season, what a comeback. And as IG circle the wagons here, they will don their armor, they will unsheathe their sword and join the Knights rivals at the round table of the next round in the LPL. These were the best highlights from today's LPL matchup. Click that subscribe button faster than Ramus can say. Okay. See you on the next one.